Hi everyone, in this video I will show how to install XAMPP for Windows. Just go to the Google, search for download XAMPP for Windows. Here you can able to observe a website called apachefriends.org, just click here. You can able to observe various kind of options like XAMPP for Windows, XAMPP for Linux, etc. I would like to download XAMPP for Windows. I would like to download the latest version, just click here on download 64 bit, which is of type around 164 MB. I have already downloaded that guys, you can just, once you download it, you can just double click here, it will ask for certain permissions I think so, just click on yes, it may take time, yes it is starting, Bitnami is the course. So guys, here it is showing some kind of warning. So because an activated user control on your system, some functions of jump are possibly restricted. USC, please avoid to install jump or deactivate USC with MS config after this setup. Okay, just click on OK. If it is not working perfectly, then we can go for any alternative process. Okay, so it is it is showing that welcome to the jump setup wizard. Just click on next. So here it is asking for to select various kind of components what you would like to install i would like to just go for all kind of components selected just click on next where you would like to install this exam i am selecting for c drive the folder is exam folder click on next selecting the language english click on next and then click on next you can, guys you can observe you can unselect this one so that it won't load any website just click on next Yes, setup is ready to begin installing XAMPP on your computer. Yes, click on next. It will uh, make some kind of process to install all the XAMPP files. Okay, guys, wait for a while. It may take some time. Yes, guys, it may take five to six minutes for the complete installation. After that, you can able to observe this wizard. Do you want to start the control panel now? Yes, I would like to start the control panel now. So I have checked it and click on finish just click on yes yes guys once your XAMPP is successfully installed in your system now your system may be converted into a kind of a server that you can do by just starting the Apache and if you want to enable the database in that server you can just start the MySQL okay guys before that I will go to the Chrome just go for searching localhost press enter it will show something like an error localhost refused to connect meaning that there is no server started present in your system that is what it is showing so what i can do is i'll just click on start for the apache observe guys it is starting at the port number 80 okay now you can observe it is automatically reloaded once you got this page now your system has started apache server you can observe guys okay fine next i will go with the phm might be for my database in this server it will show certain error it will show certain error because we didn't started the mysql database here that's why it is showing an error Okay, just click on stop. Guys, you can observe it is starting at the port number 3306. Okay, and here also it is showing that status change detected and run. Okay, guys. Yes, but if I refresh here, what will happen? It has opened successfully. That's it. This is the way you can able to uh, install XAMPP server on your system. Okay, I hope it is clear for you. Thank you.